I would rather have 70% of boys and 30% of girls. On the carpet, not on the road. Do you know, do you know what I got? Do you know what I got? On the carpet, not on the road. Do you know what I got? Hello, hola, como estas? How are you guys? Hello, hola, como estas? How are you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is a tall black cheek here again. And today's video is more like a chilled, you know, relaxed uh, mood kind of uh, video. It is called the Invade My Privacy. So, in case my eyes go this way, I am trying to look at the monitor, which is directly to me here. So, guys, um, pardon me if I tend to look that way. You know, a couple of times I'm just trying to check if everything is all right on my screen. Um, so it is um, the invade my privacy kind of tag. Um, so let me, in case you don't know what invade my privacy tag is, the invade my privacy tag is a very invasive tag about your life, which I'm sure you viewers will love. The tag is designed to show you guys my habits, my feelings, and emotions, and some general things. So here are 25, 20 invasion but fun questions. I mean, let's just start off. Uh, so my first question is, did you wake up cranky today? Not particularly. No, I didn't wake up cranky. I woke up, because uh, I worked late last night. I got home like midnight and I couldn't get enough sleep. Did that make me cranky? No, but it didn't make me cranky. It made me want to sleep more, but I couldn't because once it's 7 o'clock a.m., I can't go back to sleep again. Maybe till hours later, but I never woke up cranky today. The next question is, would you date an 18 year old at your age? I mean, I really, don't need, I really don't need to think about that twice. I don't need to think twice about that. No, I can't. Reason, 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 reason being that, I mean, I wanted, even if I want to date somebody, I have to date somebody that's like maybe um, some years older than I am because I want to learn, honestly, dating doesn't necessarily mean um, it has to involve material things. Dating you means, I mean, if you're way older than I am, it's a plus for me because I want to learn more. From you as an adult I want to expand my thinking I feel it'd be best because you already have an experience of what I, what uh, what's ahead of me and when I get to that stage I feel you actually won't guide me it boils that it boils down to the same thing when I'm dating an 18 year old I am way ahead of this person I'd rather not <laughs> I'd rather not so the next question is do you prefer to be friends with girls or boys I mean, I like being friends with both. I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings. But if it's let's do like like percentages, percentage now. I I mean, if 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 in my life right now I have girls and boys in my life, I'd rather have seventy percent of boys and thirty percent of girls. Reason being that this guy's actually going to teach you things about life. He'll tell you who's a uh, boys and who is not and they tell you how to recognize one and they tell you things you don't know much about men and that will help you um desist from them when you see them i'm not just focusing this alone on relationships no but i feel having rolling with guys gives you i mean the guys should be uh 70 percent and the girls should be 30 percent yeah would you ever smile at a stranger? <laughs> oh my god, I think I've done this like a couple of times and oh my god, you need to see my first question after I'm done smiling at people. Because my line of work here, I'm a TV presenter and <laughs> I wouldn't want to say this to um you know ruin ruin this profile. We already got. I feel we TV presenters. I think we fake we fake things a lot. Honestly, I think yeah, it works that way. If you're sick or if you're angry, like some hours before, or if I'm angry now, or if I'm angry now and I have to go on set, I have to go on TV. You see that smile? No. See that anger disappear and I put on the professional look. I think that's basically it. 
that's the same professionalism I add when I smell at strangers on the carpet. Basically that. Yeah, so yes, I smell at strangers around. On the carpet. Not on the road. No. I can't smell at you on the road when I don't know you from nowhere. Can you commit to one person? Of course I can. I mean, if... Why would you want to commit to, I mean, or commit to more than one person? when that one person is giving you all you want I mean, life is easier that way instead of you know jumping bodies I mean, body counts and prison and all this stuff i'd rather stick to one person so far the person is faithful and the person is i mean it's all i want in a man yeah i can commit to one man how do you look right now oh my god i'm looking pain like <laughs> So I got a crochet on, on my hair, and I got um, a blue top, a silver chain, a white earring, and some shorts down there. What exactly are you wearing? I think I just did everything right now, so basically that. How often do you listen to music? Oh my god. You know when they say, um, I think music is, music should come second after um, breathing in oxygen and all those stuff for me music yeah because it helps a lot music comes second after breathing breathing in oxygen that's basically me I'm sorry uh, do you wear jeans or sweats more uh, for the comfort of it I think I prefer sweats but I don't have much of that I have most of jeans so we have more of jeans than sweat. Maybe comfortable jeans, yes. I'll have more of that. But if it's not comfortable, I'll have more comfortable sweat. Do you think your life will change dramatically before 2020? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I think it will, but it won't get to 2020. Before, okay, say before 2020, yes, it will. Because I can see the signs already. Like the signs are boldly reading. I can see from here <sighs> gosh you guys don't want to know are you an introvert or an extrovert um i am an extrovert <laughs> the next question is if the person you like say they like someone else what would you say to you breath you lose your last breath your last do you know do you know what i got you just lost a huge package bruh <laughs> That's exactly what I'm going to say. Are you good at hiding your feelings? No. <laughs> I don't, I'm not good at hiding my feelings. I have, I have somebody that calls me Miss Moody. Miss Moody means like if you hurt me right now or if you offend me in a way, I become moody. Can you drive a stick shift? Guys, I don't even know. I don't even know how to drive a bicycle. Not to talk about stick shift. But it'll be fun if if I do stick shift because it makes you look professional. It makes you look like come on, like a game game person. Do you get? Do you care if people talk badly about you? <laughs> oh my god! I just hello. No, I don't care. I don't give. I, I don't give a hair for what you talk about me. So far, you're not saying in front of me. So I say not saying it in front of me, eh? You're good. We are good. But if you say in front of me, oh my God, I mean, whatever comes at you in the next seconds, you're your own. Are you going out of town soon? Hopefully, yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully. When was the last time you cried? E. Okay. So, um, some days back, I went to see a movie called God's Calling. I cried there. It's a movie, a very touching movie, like very nice and interesting. There's some emotional scenes in there. It made me cry. Have you ever liked someone you didn't expect to? Yes. <laughs> you don't want to know the list of people I liked in this life. If you would change your eye color, would you and what color would you? I'd rather just leave my eyes like this. Like, you know, this way. Forget this way. We're good on here. 
Name something you have to do tomorrow. Oh, rest, because I'm working today. <laughs> and I don't know when I'm going back home, but I'm definitely going to be resting tomorrow. What else am I doing? Am I doing anything else tomorrow? Maybe a few run around, you know. But I'm definitely resting, like, 100%. 70% resting there, maybe 30% running around, running around. Um, this one says, um, think of the last person who said I love you. Do you think they meant it? Yeah, I think they do. <laughs> I think, yes, the person meant it, meant it. Then the next one is, have you heard a song that reminds you of someone today? Oh my God, yes. Yes, 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 yes. I mean, <laughs> see the way I'm giggling. <laughs> yeah, I have. Have you ever kissed someone whose name begins with the letter A? Yeah! <laughs> see the way I screamed, like I almost forgot. I almost forgot. <laughs> I almost forgot, yeah, I think I have. Hey, yeah, I have, I have. I'm blushing. Have you ever told someone you loved them? Yes, I did. I have. I have told someone. I have told somebody I love them. Is there a boy who you, who you would absolutely do everything? Who you would do absolutely everything for? Yes, there is. <laughs> there is this is boy he's so sweet loving um wonderful he's stubborn his name is De david and he's my nephew <laughs> yeah name something you dislike about today i have crowns My God! Are you kidding me? So guys... <laughs> so they took the light now and there's nothing for me to do right now than just end this video right now. But these questions right here are so nice. Do you think I should do more of this? Lord, I'm just trying to find light. This is just too dark. Okay, guys, there we have it for today, guys. If you enjoyed watching this video, please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed. To like come your way next time, please do stay out of trouble. I love you, but God loves you more. <laughs>